Hi everyone, my name's Glenda Young and it's an absolute privilege to be um, doing this little video for Gates Head Libraries. I'm going to try and record it all in one take, so bear with me if I stumble over my words a little bit. I'm here because, um, very exciting news, my new book, The Paper Mill Girl, is coming out in paperback on March the 18th. It'll be in all the supermarkets and hopefully the library will have it too. Um, I write my books, and these are the first four, uh, they're all set in the northeast in a, a northeast coal mining village of Ryak, which is where I'm from. The books have got very strong heroines at their core. Um, they're not wishy-washy books, they're not soppy, these are real go-getting girls. Um, and I kind of focus on the, the work that they do and the communities of women that support them as well. In my first book, Belle of the Back Street, it's about a girl who takes on her dad's rag and bone round and sells second-hand clothes door to door. The second book, The Tuppenny Child, is about a young girl who comes into the village as an outsider. Uh, she's got no money, she has no friends there, she doesn't know anyone, but she's there to find uh, her baby which has been stolen. The third book, Pearl of Pit Lane, was all about women who sell their bodies to, to basically make, en you know, make ends meet. It was either do that job or, or die, basically. They had, it was their only way of earning money. So, um, so I look at the women who sold their bodies in, in pit lanes. And then The Girl with the Scarlet Ribbon um, is all about a young girl who grows up in a very grand house, um, but she's there uh, under false pretenses, shall we say. Uh, try not to give too much away about the, the, the plots of each book. And then the new book, which is just coming out, is The Paper Mill Girl. It's set in one of the northeast paper mills. We had lots of paper mills all over the northeast <coughs> in Sunderland, where I'm from. Excuse me. <coughs> we had five paper mills, and um, this is set in in one of them, which was the biggest paper mill in in the north of England. Um, the paper mill had lots of dangers. There, there was a bleaching room. Um, there, there was the machinery was very dangerous, and the, the girls who worked there especially um, had to be aware of of lots of things that have, that could cause them harm. But in the book. Um, the paper mill girl, the heroine of the book, is called Ruth, and she faces some danger at the paper mill away from the machines. Um, and I, I think that's maybe all I can say about the book. It, it is wonderful. I did a lot of research into paper mills, not all of which you read in the book, because the reader, I'm sure you're not interested in how paper mills work, but what you might be interested in is how the young girls work there, what their jobs were. Um, and again, it's all about female friendship. This one's even got a bit of friendship across a class divide when my paper mill girl becomes friends with the daughter of the, the paper mill owner. So they work together to bring down someone who's causing the girls a real problem. So that's me in a nutshell. Um, I really hope if you've read any of my books in the past that you might have enjoyed them. And if, if you want to give the paper mill girl a try, please do. I'm very proud of it. Uh, there are more books coming set in Ryup in the northeast uh, later this year. We've got the Miners Last coming out this year. Um, and I've also got a cosy crime, completely different to this genre, uh, cosy crime book set in Scarborough uh, coming out in August. And again, they'll be published with Headline. Um, so I'm very proud of that. If you'd like to know more, my website is glendayoungbooks.com and I'm on Facebook at Glenda Young Author. So please give me a follow, come and say hello and thank you again to Gateshead Libraries. Bye bye.